Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Inside of today's video, we're going to be playing some ranked, trying to discover who is meta on specific modifiers. So if I find that, that'll probably be the title of the video. But anyways, it's the first day of ranks. Things have been crazy with the servers and whatever else. In terms of where we are with randoms only, we're at a decent spot. We were like 50th in the world. Tilted a little bit on stream. But as you can see, we had a good record. So pretty decent overall. So let's just dive into some games. All right, guys, jumping into the first game then. So we're back with draft. In terms of this modifier, it, it actually is really fun, but at the same time, it's just not competitive. So, in terms of bans, late picks, I think Miko is a very strong late pick. And so, it's a go. We'll ban Miko, but even though it's a really grassy map. In terms of first picks, I think people are clocked on. Yep. Oh, we're not going to have the chance, but I really want to show you one game. I might show you guys a clip. Maybe at. Um, the end of this if we don't get the chance to play gene but gene is broken i really hope i get the chance to show you guys you've probably played one game with it already gene has infinite reload there's just not a chance that anyone's gonna leave him at the band stage but if you are before diamond you guys have got to abuse it so maybe i do make this title of the video because it's just so broken on this game mode you literally won't lose if you have gene on your team but we're against a poco and a colt we kind of need to go something with a good spray so there is Lola, there's Pam, there's Pearl. Let's see who we can go. I'm gonna go Crow actually. Someone recommended Crow. I mean, I'm not too sure. I think Fresh recommended me, so let's see. But apparently Crow just get gets like infinite ammo. Maybe we can go like defensive booster and uh shield. That's probably the way that Crow's going to thrive. And there you go, Max. Okay. So Max is going to get infinite ammo. Uh, Colt's going to get infinite ammo. It's interesting. In terms of modifiers, I'm doing a video on my main channel tomorrow on who's the best on what. Uh, on what. But on this one, I definitely like Gene, Pearl, Pam. I'm trying to think of others. Max is pretty. Just any brother with a lot of projectiles is going to be better. Miko, people have been going a lot. I tried Mortis. I didn't really feel a difference in terms of the reload speed. I don't think it helped me out that much, to be honest. In comparison to other brothers, I think people are overrating the slow reload brothers. Just go the fast reload brothers because you're literally going to get infinite ammo. So hopefully, yeah, Larry goes mid and we'll just go lane. Let's see if Crow's actually good on this modifier. I mean, we're just getting ran down right here. We're going to pop our... Oh, okay. You get infinite ammo with Crow. Okay. I didn't think that was going to be the case, but that is, that's insane. That's actually insane. But we can just keep spamming our attack. Oh, wow. Okay. Crow is kind of broke. Uh, hmm. Crow's kind of insane, but I think Larry and Laurie is going to be just any problem with multiple projectiles. It's going to be crazy on this mod fight. It doesn't feel like rules. So again, it is very fun, but this is supposed to be like ranked. So this will be an insane modifier for Mega Pig. But at least fun is what I'm having, right? That's all that matters at the end of the day. All right, so there's going to be a max pushing into me, but... Okay, maybe this title will be Crow's OP, because I don't think many people actually have clocked on. That Crow is one of the best brawlers. All right, we've got a hype charge here. Probably no chances Crow this Max can get out. Absolutely beautiful. We just need one more gem. And we're out. Okay, we don't want to push into that too much, but it's okay. We've got infinite ammo. Literally infinite ammo. These guys are running at us. <laughs> Poco's got infinite ammo. Max has infinite ammo. Everyone has infinite ammo. Just give it everybody, right? Okay, that's going to be the first round. Love to see it. I'm enjoying myself. The thing that I'm liking about these modifiers, like... Of course, I'm a competitive-minded guy, guy, right? I don't really like the idea of it, but at the same time, it makes it feel fresh. That's a good thing, right? In terms of player retention, in terms of the casuals, just keeping the map pool, uh, the, the brawler pool fresh with all these different modifiers, I, I think that stands a good chance in terms of keeping the casuals engaged. Like Big Friend, there's a lot of different compositions you can go on this. A lot of brawlers you can go. Maybe brawlers that aren't really meta, like... Crow isn't the most meta brawler, right? Lola isn't the most meta. Pam isn't. And all these brawlers are like the best on his modifiers. So we're going to pop our um, shield here. So I can just run out the max. We're just going to go as aggro as possible. Because again, I have infinite ammo, right? Everyone is dead. I don't want those gems. So we're just going to run out the Colt. Okay, maybe not the best. But we're just going to jump in on the Pokemon. Deal as much damage. But a 640 damage. That is terrible. Lowry is going in so aggro. And of course, drops all the gems, which I don't love. Also, 
if you if you guys are watching from stream today, you guys are um you guys are messed up. And the comment section is probably gonna be messed up from that stream. So if you see some sus comments today, guys. Yeah, stream happened. Stream did happen indeed. Right, we can start to sneak in here. Pop our hype charge. We can just spam stuff. <laughs> I don't know what happened there, but a lot of damage happened. Let's just put it that way. All right, we're looking good. As long as my teammates aren't going to throw here. Again, I can just go as aggro as possible. Max. Oh, this is bad. All right, infinite ammo time. Infinite ammo time. Right, we can get this Colt. He's got a gem. Beautiful. That was definitely an overextension from the Colt. All right, now time. So just keep spraying and praying. Can we get... Our ammo back. No, they can steal a gem though. Which isn't ideal. Poco, bro. How does he have so much ammo? Come on, we can get him. We can get him. We can get him. I believe. Oh, there's too many people. Body blocking. Oh, that was a messy game. We just haven't got a gem carrier. Like, one person like Larry, like, oversteps his mark. Of course, Larry isn't the best on this map, so it's pretty tough. But I reckon we still got a good chance. Like, Poco actually is pretty decent on this modifier. Like, he is spamming out those shots. Right, now time to focus up. Enough of the trolling. Enough of the yapping. We're winning this game. You guys want to see high quality content. You want to see wins on this channel. And that's all we're going to get. Are you with me? Okay. Right, here comes the Colt. Infinite ammo time. Spray and pray. Does the poison give me... I think the poison gives me more ammo. I'm not too sure. I'll have to test that out. Or it's just literally just the daggers just give me infinite ammo every single time. Well, this is crazy. Look at that. When I can get close to someone, I can actually just deal such quick damage. The, the thing I've noticed as well about this modifier, of course, reload speed's going to be... Good. Like, people with low, low reload speed's going to be really good on here. But it's more about the unload speed. If you can spam out shots so quickly, you're just going to be able to get more benefits out of this modifier like it's insane the amount of spam you can put out you know like a brawler like daryl bull etc etc so let's keep up the spam with crow this max is doing god's work gonna just run in on the poco here spamming these shots out can we get another super with crow imagine that oh, that would have been insane right i think colt's dead as well or is weak we need to try and get on a flank project here okay Drop gem from our Poco. Teammates aren't really cutting it at the moment. This is not going to plan. Really not going to plan. We'll go super. Our spike is going in. We could probably get it to Poco in time. Can we? In time. Please, please, please. Can we get a super? Oh, the plays. Holy. Crow is godly on this mode. Shout out to Fresh. I, I mean, I didn't believe it. I've hardly had any chance to try every single brawler, but Crow seriously is so underrated on this modifier. Love to see it. So we're going to be able to get a win there. Some clutch plays. You're able to charge super and hypercharges so quickly with this brawler. I absolutely... I'm having fun on this modifier, even though it's not competitive. I'm having fun. I've got to admit, I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I had fun. All right. So that's going to be the first game. Get a mastery rank up as well. Love to see it. Let's hop into the next one. Guys, jumping into the second and the last game for today's video. And I'm glad we got big friends. So this modifier I've only got three times. This is the third time. So, and it's on, um, wait, who do I need to bam? Who else is a good counter to, uh, I just don't know. I've not played this game mode enough. I don't know, Otis, no idea who's the best. I think Colette and Frank are clearly like the two brawlers that you want. Oh, 8-bit, I could have banned 8-bit, I completely forgot about it. Okay, there you go, Fang. Which is good. High HP brawler, but also a good assassin. Who could we go? We need a high high HP brawler, which is actually pretty decent. Maybe Pam. Pam could be an underrated one. Do I go Pam? No, Sam is not the play. I mean, Sam could be underrated here. Let's see if there's any other high HP brawlers that are... I mean, RT could be underrated. I think Pam. Pam's going to be the high HP brawler that we pick. It's not like tank level of HP, but it's decent. We can go even higher if needed, especially if they like, if they double down on the tankiness. I don't know, if they go buzz, they go something like that. We can go primo and counter them. We've already got Charlie to shut down Fang. We've got uh, Pam as well. 
I think we're in a good position. Larry and Laurie. Okay, that is definitely a brother that I was scared about. Uh, oh, I, they'll have a lot of HP. Oh, no. Oh, that isn't good. But maybe we can go. Last pick, Echo. I don't know how to feel about this modifier, to be honest, guys. <laughs> like, I, I have fun on the other modifier, but this one is a bit... Mm. Okay, bro no, Brock? No, surely not Brock. Like, anything but Brock. There's so many better options than Brock. Bo. I mean, Piper. I don't know. We'll let him decide. Again, I'm going to have to play this modifier a few more times to really know what is the best. You'll have to let me know down in the comment section below what you guys have seen. Like, I honestly need your guys' suggestions because I want to do a video on it tomorrow. And I'm kind of clueless. Like, people go Piper, but then I'm like, well, Piper having a lot of HP seems good. But at the same time, Piper hits better against those squishy brawlers, right? And if everyone's high HP, Piper's not going to be able to thrive. But at the same time, you need big damage. So I'm like... Who is actually good on this modifier? I've seen Miko actually be good as well, but I was like, how is Miko good? He's good against Squishy Brothers. I don't know. It, it's a mess. This modifier is a mess. Let, let's just be frank about that. Okay, I am not going against Larry and Laurie, but someone has to. Oh. I mean, if anyone, like... I don't know, actually. Right, can we gadget this Larry? We can. Get the pinch on... Oh, ah. Right, we're just a normal pound though. That, that's 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 it. But my teammates are a lot higher HP than usual. I'm right, gonna pop another gadget on this Larry, even though it didn't really do much. Just run at him. Like it actually feels like I can't kill him. Like this is crazy. Normally I could just run into a Larry as a pound and kill him. Bro has <laughs> bro has so much HP. Also, I didn't check. I bet if you shield, I, I think that must increase the hp pool as well so i probably should use shield on palm right that's the maths let me let me check okay they've got 8600 hp let me i don't, don't know what fang has as much my hp let's see okay okay it doesn't match the shield that's good to know that would have been a cool little trick but glad that's not the case oh oh okay we are we are not dead no we're not dead i thought we were cooked but we're not cooked I thought, oh, okay, see you later, Pearl. Somehow she's dead. What on earth was that from our Charlie? Well, it's all good. Just a Larry and Laurie. There's no way he has enough DPS to take on his all, so. Let's just try and run at him. I mean, he's just going to be annoying. He's going he's gonna to try and 1v3, but seriously, bro. I think just, just let it go. Yeah, he's trying. Also, Laurie has an increase in HP. That would have been interesting. Imagine if it buffed your super HP as well. Yeah, let's get the pinch going. Let's just get him to waste his ammo. He's trying, bless him. But there's no chance against us. Right, I like the pump pick. Loki, I like it. Again, I, what I should do when I'm playing this modifier, I need a list. I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to be that guy and be a nerd, right? I'm going to get a spreadsheet up. At least put the brawler HPs up. That, that's a good idea. I think that's going to help me on this modifier. Because like a brawler that has good range and high HP, like RT, like 8-bit, like Pam. It's an underrated pick. It really is. Because people just think straight away. Well, tanks. But you can't really go many tanks on knockout, right? Like, tanks can just get countered too easily. So, you may as well leave yourself with a semi-decent brawler like Pam. Alright, let's see if we can get Pearl low. I mean, she is very low, but we can't skill the kill, unfortunately. We're close to super. I can definitely put that in the middle. Come on, Charlie. Heal up. I've got you for a little while. Right, we might as well put this turret. Oh, no. Larry's just going to destroy it. Okay, maybe we can get him down. Maybe with the help of my teammates. No? Okay, nice. Good from the Charlie. We should be able to confirm this kill. Easily hit spam. Nice. Good from Charlie. Nearly went from losing one player. Clutch super. We win it. Let's see. This fang's got to try it. I know it. Okay, he's not going to try it now, right? Bit of a waste of super. No way he's going to get out of this. There we go. Just one win away from getting it. Let's secure it, guys. Oh, God, my, my mind is fried. It's nearly 11 p.m. What the servers have done to my brain is just too much. Hopefully, we have a lag-free day. Okay, looks like my pal is just completely given up. 
But that's okay. We're all gonna win anyways, right? A little bit of an anticlimactic ending, to be honest. I don't like it when people give up. But I guess... That's just how it is. Right. That's going to be it for today's video, guys. Let me know down in the comment section below what videos you want me to see. Do you just want me to go through all of the OP brawlers in ranked? Give you guys the best tips. You know, that, all that juicy stuff. I'll try to give you guys the best ranked content ever. I'm really going to try and hit the mark this time around. And we're literally five ELO away from Diamond 3. But yeah, that's going to be it for today's video. Make sure to check out my stream tomorrow. 59th in the world. Love to see it. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.